Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Guys, you know the drill. Before we get started, go ahead and obliterate that subscription button. Gently, boop, the notification bell. And when you're done, check out michaelsfishroom.com. Now, it's Sunday, hopefully, when you're watching this video. Right now, I'm prepping about 30 boxes. I'm getting the insulation ready, the heat pack, make sure I have enough heat packs. Got the samples from Super Cichlids going in. Have a special uh, uh, deal from my aquarium box going in. So if you've thought about ordering fish, go ahead, boom, michaelsfishroom.com, shipping now. Also, I'd like to say a big congratulations to my friend Graham from Aquarium Adventures. Check out Graham's channel in this general area. Graham hit 5,000 subscribers uh, the other day, and I want to say congratulations. Graham's channel is very similar to mine in that uh, he just kind of turns on the camera and goes. Uh, he does edit a little bit more than me, but um, I like Graham. Like I said, we're pretty similar. If you, if you do stop by his channel, make sure you subscribe. Give him a thumbs up in a video and leave a comment and let him know I sent you because uh, that would be kind of cool. All right, guys. Today, a local fish store tour from San Jose, California. Um, grab a snack and a beverage. It's kind of a long one and there is a poop ton of bloopers at the end. I was trying to film this exact intro in my hotel room and I just, I wasn't into it. And I, there's literally like 20 takes, it's hysterical. Uh, this fish store was great. I didn't really do it justice, however. I kind of was in a little bit of a hurry. I had met uh, Barbara Jackson. She was a subscriber of mine. She also was a customer of mine. I'm a customer of hers. And um, she picked me up at my hotel. We drove about an hour to San Jose and to this fish store. And then I had dinner with her and her husband. It was really nice. But uh, Barbara also has a small channel. Check that out in the, this area here. But special shout out to Lynn and Ariel from the, uh, the local fish store. They were really cool. Um, they didn't really talk on camera, which is okay. Sometimes people don't like that. But um, they were really cool. And I appreciate all their help. So guys, like I said, grab a snack and a beverage and stand by. Hi, fishy folks from San Jose, California at Neptune Aquatics. I'm here with Barbara. Say hi, Barbara. Hi, Barbara. <laughs> and we're gonna go inside. Barbara doesn't wanna be on camera, so maybe I'll just do this. Just kidding. All right, guys, this is a pretty cool store. I walked in, of course, asked if I could film, and uh, I took a quick look around, and it's really nice. <clears throat> anyway, here's a little cube. I don't know how big it is, but uh, it's a typical Japanese style tank as you've seen in some of my Japanese fish store tours. Uh, very neat and clean. You can see some shrimp and some tetras. Moving on, we have some discus and angels. Wow, that is a nice looking angel. And uh, a little driftwood. Wow, that's some driftwood. Looks like they're doing the dry start method to start this tank. That's pretty cool looking. Another Japanese style tank, stuff growing out of the top. I say Japanese style, like I say China filter. I hope nobody's offended because, you know, it really bothers me if you get offended. Rainbow tank. Nice looking rainbow tank. That's, are those are eggs? No, that's just air. I thought those were eggs at first. Wow! saltwater tank that's pretty cool little neptune aquatic sticker i'm gonna have to buy because this place is already nerding me out with how cool it is that's amazing amazing Oof. another saltwater tank so i don't know for eighty five hundred dollars do you get everything in the tank or do you just get the tank that's a good question but i don't make that much money so store is a uh, pretty heavily salt water got some fresh water I'll show you those tanks we'll look at them together for the first time because I haven't seen them nice looking clowns I I just told Berber as we were walking into the store I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be getting a salt water tank soon soon eventually let's go with eventually more salt water and clowns and anemones and anemones I don't know I don't think there's anything in here that I can see. Maybe it's just cycling? I don't know. Looks like they're, I don't know. Let's check out this saltwater tank. <gasps> That's a pretty cool looking fish. I don't know anything about saltwater fish other than clownfish and anemones. 
I keep saying anemone because I don't know how to say it and it's funny. Look at that clownfish. That is pretty spectacular. Looks like he's wearing sunglasses. Wow. I'm gonna have to come back and take pictures. All right. What is this? Oh, this is the setup. I think I've seen this before. It's like a, I don't know what it is. I'm making it up as I go along. I have no idea. All right, let's look at tanks. This is California, so everything's immediately expensive. I don't know why. Here's a tank for driftwood. You can keep driftwood in it, that's it. 2,500 bucks. Maybe I'll buy two. Think I can take them as carry-ons? I don't. Lots of tanks, saltwater tanks. Well, I say saltwater tanks, but they're reefer tanks. What are these looking, delicious looking tanks? 160 bucks, so already past my budget. Hmm, interesting. Mr. Aqua. All right, what do we got over here? <laughs> nice wood. Got the API section. We've got the Seachem section, planted chemicals foods and so on and so forth. Dr. Tim's, all right. Guppies, Snow White Platinum Guppy, $15. I wonder, hey, look, Pingus. I wonder if they have males and females. Because if they do, I might have to try to smuggle some home. I am only seeing males though. Oh well. That is a ginormous sponge filter. That is a pretty cool looking sponge filter, people. All right, what else? Bamboo shrimp, wild brown shrimp. I'm being beckoned up above that there are ginormous sponge filters. I don't, you think that's the same one as that one? I think it might be. We're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to ask. CF-250. I don't know. I just want one because it's so big. All right. Where was I at? Tetras. Ooh, what is that? Little stream loaches. It says there's guppies in there. Maybe it's that one. One guppy. Looks like we got water change. They can add water and maybe a drip system also. Interesting. All right. Panda guppies and endlers. I don't see any pandas, but I do see endlers. And some some snails. No, no pandas. There's some guppy babies though. That's pretty neat. Alright, moving on. Tetras, Priscilla Tetras, some cardinals maybe? I don't see any cardinals. It says there's cardinals. Maybe they're sold out. Nice looking fish though. Eheim filters in every tank. Super Red Plecos, $25. Wow, I should consider raising my prices. <laughs> uh, Goldie Pleco, L14. Let's, let's look. He's probably hiding somewhere if he's in the tank. I don't see him. All right, what do we got down here? Some epistogramma, Cory's. Cockatoides. Nice looking fish so far. How you doing? Good, how are you? Wanna say hi? Hi. <laughs> What's your name? Ariel, how are you? Hi Ariel. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm Mike. That was Ariel, she works here. Everyone say hi to Ariel. More Tetras. Good looking stock. So far I haven't seen any any issues in tanks really. Looks like they try to keep a pleco in each tank. Oh look, look at that. L172A.
Yeah. That's pretty cool. I love plecos. I'm a pleco guy. What can I say? I'm also a guppy guy, though. All right. Got some CO2 kits. Uh, scaping tools. Plants. Some live bearers in here. Some platies. And, whoa. I don't know why it's not auto-focusing, folks. Probably because I'm an idiot. Anyway, no guarantee on fish and other livestock. That's interesting. Rainbows. Kohaku sword tails. Red eyes, though. Rummy nose tetras. Anubis is... Uh, I was going to say breeding. Anubis is spawning. What's the word I'm looking for? I can't, I don't know. You're gonna tell me in the comments below. Anubis is flowering. That's what I'm going with. I think that's right. Got the muck guppy tank. 450 for male guppies, not a bad price. Some nice looking ones in here. CO2 in the back, see it? Nice looking plants. Little baby angels. Uh, oh, there we go. There's the prices on the angels for you angel folks. Not too many in there. They must be low. More guppies. More plants. That's a nice looking guppy. What do we got? Assorted female guppies. 250 Not bad. A little skinny. She's a fatty. I mean that in the most respective way. Miss, m mismatch tank. Mishmash? A bunch of different stuff. Ooh. What is that? Is that a black tiger? Yeah, no, I understand. Tetra? Tiger bark. Black tiger bark. That's what I'm trying to say. All right. More plants. And rainbows. They're creepy looking in more plants. Tissue cultures. Tanks. Oh. Aqua Japan. I'm gonna have to bring one of those back. Hakari Foods, Bug Bites. What is this? Max Breed. Shrimp food. I can't read it. All right, let's move on, folks. I have to hang it up first. Stand by. Okay, we're good. All right, more fresh water. Real reef rubbles. I, I don't know. Is that that? Oh, it must be that. Okay. Shrimp. Got some discus. Mm, some decent ones. Temperature controllers. I'm not sure if they're on. We're gonna have to check. Hey, discus dude. Fried shrimp, gumbo shrimp, garlic shrimp. Yep, I don't have any new jokes. More shrimp. It's a big tank for shrimp. 75 gallon just for like 15 shrimp. It's a little overboard, don't you think? But, oh my. <laughs> I, these big filters are fantastic. I must buy one. More discus, quite a few discus. And then another shrimp tank. Got the cobalt. The cobalt uh, airline. I'm going to check out this water change system somehow. All right. We got salt water, which you know I know nothing about. But we're going to look at some corals. Try to stay away from the people. Very cool. There's a lot of people over there, so we're gonna go over here. Some big corals. Some expensive corals. I'm I'm gonna have to ask. I, I don't I, this is 500 bucks. I, I'm telling you those clowns are badass though. Onyx, 
Sequest, 75. I'd pay 75 for that clownfish. If that's exactly what it is. <gasps> flower rock. Rock flower. I was hoping it was a flower horn. It's not. I, I'm, I'm confused. What is 400, 500 bucks? Look at your baby clowns. They're so cute. They are adorable. I have to get a salt water tank. It's that simple. That simple. All right, fishy folks. We got some hardscaping materials. They've got wood. Big wood. Oh, food over there. Let's go check out their food. Fritz Reef Pro. Big into salt water. So they got Rapashi. NLS. Cobalt. Uh, Tetra and Hakari and Bug Bites. Got a little bit of Sarah. And then we go into chemicals for salt water. Lots of parts. You can talk, it's okay. Want me on camera? No? Anyone? All right. You know, bulkheads, pretty cool. Bulkhead parts. Okay, I'm in love with these black clownfish. I can't, I can't deny it anymore. <sighs> they are spectacular. Spectacular. Anemone. Alright. Look, they got the sumps down below. Very cool. Got some tools. Coral saw. Coral cutters. Glues. Oh, to mount corals, I guess. All right, we got some frozen. Ocean Nutrition, Piscine. Hikari, of course. Lots of Hikari. What else? More parts. I like the parts. I'm not going to lie. Little tiny uh, unions. Valves. I like it. I like having parts. I'm cheap. I buy other stuff cheaper, but, you know, some people don't know. More stuff. Something just caught my eye. Oh. San Francisco Bay Brand Hatchery Kit. Pretty cool. All right, fishy folks. We're getting a little long-winded here, but I have to show you this. Colored PVC available. Very cool. Filter stuff, more stuff. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the quick tour. Neptune Aquatics, San Jose, California. See ya. Hi, fishy folks. Today, a local fish store tour. Now, obviously, I'm filming this uh, after I film the video, and the reason is I love this store, and the video doesn't really do it justice. So grab a snack and a beverage, sit tight, look around. I wish I would have filmed longer, but uh, I didn't, and this is a <laughs> joke. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Back from my trip to uh, Oakland, California, and while I was there, I met a fantastic person, Barbara Jackson, who is a uh, subscriber of mine. She's been around a while. Uh, not a while, it's not like she's old. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Guys, today, a local fish store tour from San Jose, California. I met a subscriber, Barbara Jackson, and we had a great time at this local fish store. So grab a snack and a beverage, and uh, I hope you like it. And go visit this store. It is fantastic. I really didn't do it justice. The staff was amazing. Uh, in fact, one of the staff members recognized me. He didn't really want to go on camera, but um, what am I talking about? All of a sudden, got an itch. Hey, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Guys, today, a local fish store tour from San Jose, California, where I met, no, because I planned to meet her. 
<clears throat> Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I'm back from my trip to California. I am packing multiple orders, getting everything ready to ship tomorrow, and uh, I shouldn't probably. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Today, a local fish store tour from San Jose, California. When I planned my California trip, I uh, don't know what I'm going to say. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I'm back from my business trip to California, where I met a fantastic subscriber and friend, Barbara Jackson. You may know Barbara Jackson from some streams. She has a small channel. There'll be a link somewhere in this general area for you to check it out. She has a small fish room. A fish room tour will be coming soon from her fish room. We went to a great local fish store, Neptune Aquatics, and this store is fantastic. Now it's mostly salt water. They do have fresh, but mostly salt. And it really made me want to buy some salt water tanks. Not, not tanks, one tank, I don't know. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. I'm back from my trip to California where it was cool and rainy all day. And uh, every day, all day. <sighs> Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Uh, back from my trip from California where it was sunny and rainy, pretty much sunny and rainy. It can't be sunny and rainy. Fishy folks and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I was in California in uh, Oakland for business all week, but I'm back. While I was in Oakland, I did meet uh, and I had planned this ahead of time to meet a subscriber of mine, Barbara Jackson. She has a small channel and that link will be somewhere in this general area. Check it out. Um, Barbara and I went to this local fish store, Neptune Aquatics, which was spectacular. My tour did not do the store justice. If you're within a few hours of the store, definitely go check it out. Hope, uh, oh, Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I just got back from my business trip a couple days ago. And uh, while I was in California, I did this local fish store tour. I also met a subscriber of mine, Barbara Jackson. Barbara's been in some streams and she has a small channel and she's involved with uh, some other uh, YouTubers as well. No, that sounds... Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone is having a great fishy week. I'm back from my business trip from Oakland, California. And while I was there, I met a subscriber, Barbara Jackson. Barbara has a small YouTube channel as well. Make sure you check it out. Uh, subscribe, like all her videos, you know, do the normal cool stuff. And uh, Barbara and I went on this local fish store tour to Neptune Aquatics and it was epic. The store is amazing. My video does not do it justice. If you're within driving distance, definitely take a trip. It's well worth it. I also want to give a big shout out to Ariel and Lynn from the store. Uh, both of them talked to us. Unfortunately, not on camera, but that's okay. Not everyone likes to be on camera. It's not a big deal. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I was in California for business all week and uh, I'm back now. Got a lot of work to do in the fish room, uh, starting to make boxes and stuff for shipping. Michael's fish room is now shipping. This is, that's not the Hi, fishy folks and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I am uh, in California. California. Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I'm back from my business trip in California, although this video is filmed from the hotel room. Today, a local fish store tour from Neptune Aquatics. Hi, fishy 
Fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I am back from my business trip to California. I, I, yeah, I'm gonna go take a shower. <clears throat> Hi, fishy folks, and happy Sunday fun day to you. Hope everyone had a great fishy week. I'm back from my trip to California, uh, where I met... Gotta do this when I get home.